Bismillah, salatu wassalam, ala rasulillah. Okay, uh, we will start the second session uh, about concerning the uh, the manuscript or the thesis about uh, how to uh, use uh, Bismillah, salatu wassalam, ala rasulillah. Chosen language. How to use chosen language to create and to implement uh, what is called the Megatron. Okay, this is the, the purpose of uh, this session. Okay, uh, I don't know, the last time uh, I asked you to uh, check the book to learn how to program with this language, Chisel. Uh, I don't know uh, how many chapters uh, uh, did you read. And at the same time, I asked you to write the first chapter of the manuscript asked you to uh, write the, to begin uh, or to start the first chapter uh, to begin with I need to get a response from you mm -hmm. to know uh, what you did uh, this week or uh, the, the, the level of your progression or if you need uh, that I explain something, maybe I could explain uh, Megatron if you want. I saw partially the book. I read the uh, I read the uh, the first chapter, and uh, I saw. I don't know if uh, you installed the uh, the compiler or not. Yeah, I need interaction here. I don't know what's happening. Can you give me your progress state?
it's just uh, an option normally you, normally it's here it's just an option here no it's not here <coughs> okay normally it works normally here it's working normally it's working now uh, you really need to uh, to add the microphone this is a really difficult to uh, to interact this way Okay, uh, do you hear me? I will try to uh, to use the voice now to uh, try to talk and explain using the voice without the chat. Okay, we don't have much time left. I will try to explain. Uh, we will concentrate today we will try to understand stand the conditional circuits Today, okay. Uh, what is a combination of circuits? A combination. Okay, let's see. Uh, okay, uh, combination of circuits. Let's see. I will show you my course. What is it? Okay, a combination of circuit. A combination of circuit is, is a digital electronic circuit which internally perform a binary processing from input to output. Anyway, you have I will just give you an overview. You have to uh, to dive uh, to deep dive in those concepts to well understand how the combinational circuit uh, works. You have the course. You have uh, some of my videos. You have the videos of uh, what did your colleagues in the previous years. You have those videos too. And uh, uh, try to understand exactly what, uh, how a combinational circuit works. Anyway, a combinational circuit is uh, represented this way with the N input and um, M outputs. The inputs uh, will be later represented by uh, we see that later we will be represented by uh, what we call the variables the variables of a function are the inputs of your circuit of the combinational circuit and you have uh, the outputs are the functions here uh, for instance you have function one function one represent uh, the output f1 function 2 represent the output f2 uh, to create a, a combinational circuit you need to follow what we call a, a method a five step method like uh, uh, for instance here this method this uh, method will use uh, a global schematic, a truth table, a canonical function forms, 
uh, kernel of map and schematic. The, more, uh, the most important thing here is the schematics. But uh, to, be, uh, to be fair with you, you will not need to perform this method. Actually, what you will need is to program to program the combinational circuit using uh, chisel, using chisel. For instance, I know that uh, the combinational circuits are treated here, are treated in the next chapter, this, this is not uh, far from the, the beginning. Here you have a combinational circuit, you have to understand that, you have to read that, how to uh, create a combinational circuit. For instance, this is a combinational circuit. Uh, to, be, to, be, to be honest, it is very easy to create a combinational circuit using chisel. It's very, very easy. easy. It's different uh, from creating a combinational circuit using a logic gate, for instance. You have to read that. This is uh, your work, you have to read that. You have to read how to create a, a combinational circuit. Of course, I, uh, I mentioned that if you can't understand the chisel on your PC, you have to go to the their GitHub and from here, in this position, this is it. Gets get, getting started. Uh, bootcamp interactive tutorial and online chisel bootcamp. And this website, I will post it on. Uh, I will post it on uh, Discord. You can have an online compiler and simulator for chisel. For instance, I can choose here Scala, and you have to read, uh, to write your code here, and compile here. Compile this way. Okay, it, it will take some time to compile. Anyway, this is the way if you have not installed a Chisel in your uh, computer, for instance. Like me, for instance, I didn't install Chisel on my computer. The way to do is to use an online compiler. <coughs> okay. Uh, what can I say here? We have don't care. You, when, uh, you don't have to do all of this stuff. This stuff are done automatically by the, uh, by the compiler. And you have here well some well known uh, combinational circuit. For instance, you have multiplexer and demultiplexer. I already uh, gave you the uh, the homework to create a multiplexer using chisel. Using chisel. Why? Because the multiplexer is the, the well-known combinational circuit. You have to implement that in Chisel. It's very easy. You will see it's very easy. You have to uh, implement uh, multiplexer. We will need uh, multiplexers for sure in our implementation of uh, Megatron. Uh, anyway, the well-known uh, combinational circuits out there are multiplexers, uh, encoders, decoders, uh, priority controller, uh, priority controller, here, encoder, decoder, we will see that later, maybe, maybe, the, yes, I guess we will need a decoder, I don't remember exactly, but, but those two also are well-known combinational circuits, for instance, the, the decoder is a combinational circuit uh, often used inside uh, memories like RAMs or ROMs, we have a priority controller, a priority controller, uh, other substructor. Uh, you have a multiplier divider. We will need multiplication. No, no, we don't have a multiplier in our implementation. Anyway, we, uh, comparator, 
shifter, alu, etc., etc. Anyway, I will give you. I will give you. Uh, you have to implement arbiter in the book too. I will give you the uh, documentation of the course, and you have uh, to read uh, by yourself the course. I will need, I repeat, I will need uh, you to install the microphone to know exactly what you did. I have uh, to, uh, uh, to give you some questions and to to follow you to know exactly what are you doing what are you doing anyway i will give you the course in english even though uh, is it already uh, online the um, the french version is online i will give you the the course There it is. Okay. Okay, I think this is uh, 4 p.m. I need to go. I need to go uh, for the, I have to precise that, for the, Next week, you need, you have to understand combinational national circuits. Circuits and two and Clement combinational and to implement a multiplexer. A multiplexer uh, eight to one. Do you have questions? Do you have any question? Don't forget to install the vocal next time. Assalamu alaikum.